Okay, guys, we have everyone's attention. Each year, since we've been doing the um, since we've been doing the holiday party, uh, we put together a little award show. And the award show really is just a, a way to kind of recognize some of the different um, families or um, students that are involved in Team Creek. And I always start off by saying, um, really, it, you know, it's one of those moments when you're giving awards out that you realize, well, not everyone's going to get an award, right? Like some of you are going to not get one, unfortunately, and, and it can be a little bit like disappointing. But I think, um, I think in those in those situations where everybody gets the trophy or everybody gets the award, it makes those trophies and those awards mean a whole lot less. So um, I'm I'm a big proponent of not everybody gets the trophy and not everybody gets the award, and it really is based a little bit more on merit. So um, if you didn't get chosen for an award, please don't be sad. Don't be don't be disappointed. It's a very very difficult um, process choosing people for a, an award, um, and we, you know, we do our best to uh, to be as fair as we possibly can. Um, so let's just get going with it, and this is the 2023 awards. We're going to start off, yeah, how about a little more? We're going to start off with a category of fitness, and the first, um, the first category there's actually a couple of fitness categories here. The first one is, um, it's actually LB Triple E, which is a, a saying that I learned many years ago. And LB Triple E just stands for leadership by example with the energy for excellence, okay? So and the first award goes to Vivian Porcelli. <laughs> with the sun. Congratulations. So with that said, well, you can read it, right? You're up. I'm not going to read it. Too. But it's really, if you don't know, Vivian has actually uh, become a fitness fitness certified, or how, how do you say it? You um, got your certification? Yeah, for, certified personal trainer. Certified personal trainer. All right. So give her some energy for that. <laughs> and then the next, uh, the next fitness award is actually the Fitness Transformation Award. Um, and this one actually goes to someone who's not here, and that's Brian Keyes, but his son Brody will accept on his behalf. Brian has lost at least 80 pounds. Am I right? Do you know, do you know how many? Yeah, actually more. The, yeah, the last time I talked to Brian, he said he had lost 80 pounds. Wow. 80 pounds. So uh, he's really killing it. He's doing like uh, Iron Man things or at least triathlons or something. He's doing some some crazy training now. So it's pretty amazing, so we'd love to see that. Um, next up, uh, we got a couple a couple of words in this same category. It was hard to just pick one. Uh, it's called Perseverance Award. And it says for overcoming adversity and sticking to your goal of becoming a black belt. To be successful in any endeavor requires the ability to stay the course. You have shown this quality in training, and we are proud to have you representing the Team Freak Tribe. The first one goes to Frankie Bannon. Where's Frankie? All right, congratulations. Can I get us a hug? All right, you rock. Frankie, um, you didn't always test exactly on schedule, did you? But you didn't give up, so that's why that's why we uh, we thought of you for the perseverance award. Okay, give it one more round. Of and we have a second one, and this goes to Luca. Wow. Luca. All right. Can I get a handshake? You rock, sir. All right. The next one, new category. It's called the comeback category. It's very similar to the Perseverance Award, except for this category is for when someone actually stops training. They stop training, but then they actually come back. All right? And uh, so it says for an enthusiastic return after a period of uh, being away, often when someone is away from their training, it becomes easier to stay away than it is to get back to it. 
You have overcome this phenomenon and shown an impressive result for your training. Our first award goes to Evelyn Walter. She stopped for a little bit, thought it was the end, but then she said, no, I'm going for black belt. Congratulations. And we have a second one in this category. This one is... Anthony! I think they were, they were laying odds back there on him. <laughs> Congratulations. And welcome back, by the way. Okay. Our next award is called the Dedication Award. It says for devoting yourself to your practice. You've always shown steady consistency for your martial arts practice and have made training a priority for yourself. This dedication has been instrumental with your success in the martial arts. We love having you part of the Team Three Tribe. This goes to Samantha John. Okay, another category. This one is the Loyalty Award. And it says, for consistent support and allegiance, the Team Creep family is fortunate to have you as part of the team, and we're forever grateful for your display of loyalty. Having students like you is what makes the Team Creep try to thrive. Now that really describes all of you guys. I mean, like it really does. Uh, but we, we wanted to make special recognition to the Kazai family. Come on up, Kazai. Those of you that are here, we got three out of four of you out here. All right. Oops. Oops. Yes. All right. It's called Intensity. You have consistently demonstrated intensity in your performance. Powerful techniques, facial expressions, and projecting your voice are all positive qualities you possess. Continue to lead by example and excel in your practice of the martial arts. We're proud to have you part of the Team Creek Tribe. The Intensity Award goes to Yeshua. Come on up, Yeshua. can count on you to bring the intensity. Nice work. Nice. All right. The next category is similar, uh, but we, we changed its name a little bit. This was the Energy Award. Uh, it says, for enthusiastic effort and energy you bring to your training each class, you are a spirit leader, and your energy often spreads to others. This is a very positive quality, so keep doing what you're doing. We love having you part of the Team Creek Tribe. How about a hand for Ruby Fandon? What? Can I get a shake? Or maybe a hug? Yeah. We got a new category this year. The new category says best footwork. For demonstrating proper footwork, which leads to great agility and dexterity, your sparring rounds are always exciting to watch. Keep up the great effort and keep being awesome. We love having you part of the Team Creek Tribe. What, Vivian Rowe? Yeah. Okay. Moving right along. Oh, no, I just got two. This one's a tough, this one's a tough category to win. The best detail award says for exemplary detail in each and every performance, you sh you show you have an eye for detail in the discipline to put in the time to develop that detail. Keep leading by example and being the model of excellence for all members of the Team Creek Tribe. This one goes to... This one's 
always uh, an exciting one to hand out. It's tough. It was uh, I've seen a few few students that have really jumped up a lot in their, their progress as far as their overall skill level. Uh, so it says you for for your determination in developing your skill to a higher level, your overall coordination is noticeably improved. Congratulations, your hard work is paying off. We are excited to watch your skills continue to develop and are proud to have you part of the Team Creek Tribe. This award goes to Dylan Pride. new category this time. It's called High Academic Achievement for individuals who have demonstrated outstanding scholarly achievements, exceptional dedication to their studies, and a profound commitment to intellectual growth. This award celebrates not only academic progress, but also the relentless pursuit of knowledge and the ability to inspire others in the pursuit of academic excellence. I think we have two for this one. The first one goes to Fox J. <laughs> Number two, it's in the family. The crucial brain. Do I get a hug? Right. Yeah. Okay. Let's go on. Oh, we only have one more. The coveted. This is the coveted, guys. The coveted MVP. Most valuable player. And this one's super hard to pick, guys, right? This is <laughs> This year, well, let me read it first. For consistently being an ambassador for Team Creek Tribe, your willingness to help and your enthusiasm towards being a student of the martial arts does not go unnoticed. Thank you for being an integral part of the TCMA family. Our MVP is... MVW! Kids probably at least are anxious to get into those presents, yeah, yeah. right? 